Welcome back to Strength for Today for July 13th. He is Lord. Let's look at Revelation 22:13. Revelation 22:13 says, I am the Alpha and the Omega, the first and the last, the beginning and the end. He is Lord. Lord is a descriptive word used to illustrate God's oversight over all of time, past, present, and future. For example, Alpha and Omega, the first and the last letters of the Greek alphabet, beginning and end, and first and last, suggest God rules over everything from the first to last and everything in between. Three times in Revelation, the phrases are found in the words of Christ describing himself. Revelation 1.8, 21.6, and 22 verse 13. In the book that presents an overview of the culmination of human history on this earth, these words signify that Christ is Lord over all that is yet to come. He has been Lord over the past, He is Lord over the present, and He will be Lord over everything yet to come in His redemptive plan for mankind. Not only is Christ Lord over human history, He is Lord over your future as well, the things yet to come in your life. We may not know what the future holds, but we know who holds the future. That's true. I know my grandma would always say that. We don't know what the future holds, but we know who is holding our future, right? And so if we know that Jesus is holding our future and God cares about us, then we don't have to worry, right? Like the world does. Everyone's wringing their hands and so worried about what might be happening. But guess what? We know that God cares about us and he knows our future. He knows what's going to happen tomorrow and the next day and the next day. And he has a plan for us. So that just makes it really comforting to me knowing that even though this world is kind of in chaos and I mean, lately we've had COVID and there's wars and a lot of things going on. The stock market, I guess, is going down and all kinds of crazy things. And yet he always is he was, and he is yet to come. He's in our future. And so when you know that he's in your future, that really helps you not to worry. So I hope today that you don't worry and that you just trust in him, that he always is, always will be, and that your future is safe because he's holding you right here, my friends. So rest in that, that he's holding you. Have a great day, and we'll see you back here tomorrow. You can order your own copy of Strength for Today by Dr. David Jeremiah by going to davidjeremiah.org or calling Turning Point at 877-998-0222. And I would like to answer any question you may have about faith in Jesus. Just email me through my website, nancyjoytoyou.com. I hope you lean on God's strength and have a fantabulous day.